Sandusky County is the kind of place where you would want to raise your kids. It's very warm, it's very welcoming, it's very rural. My name is uh, Chris Hilton. I am the sheriff of Sandusky County in Northwest Ohio. This is not the kind of place where a crime like this occurs. Uh, it's the place that something like this is a shock. In April of 2015, Heather Bogle went to work at the Whirlpool Corporation located in Clyde, Ohio. My name is Sean O'Connell. I was the lead investigator of the Heather Bogle investigation. She worked midnights, which means she would clock in roughly at 10, 1030 in the evening. She worked her shift and she clocked out at a, a, approximately 617 that following morning. She was last seen leaving the parking lot of the Whirlpool Corporation. And then she disappeared. She failed to pick up her daughter from school. And this was like clockwork. She never failed to pick up her daughter. The Sandusky County Sheriff's Department tonight is working to solve a mystery. Where is 28-year-old Heather Bogle? Her family is the one that they, within hours, they were posting signs, putting things on Facebook and all other types of social media. I think somebody has her and they need to bring her home. Why would they uh, want to uh, kidnap her? I don't know. And as the, the, the minutes and the hours went by, people became more and more worried because they could not find her. She doesn't have any enemies that we know of. We just have no idea how this could happen. She had a lot of chaos going on. A lot of things were going on in her personal life. She was vulnerable at that point. She's an amazing woman, and she's always there for me, and we want her to know we're here for her. This is solved the old-fashioned way, bit by bit, tracking down every potential lead because you never know when that lead turns into a break. The day after she disappeared, I get a phone call from the sheriff's office that Heather's vehicle had been located. I had roll patrol unlock the vehicle, and then we popped the trunk, and we saw something that we did not expect to see. I don't think anybody had a clue about the mystery, the intrigue, and the story that was going to come out of the opening of that trunk.